So Quora, the Nigerian singer, dancer, choreographer, whatever she does, West African Nigerian lady. Yesterday, her and her sister went on a rampage, okay? Disrespecting South Sudanese, okay? Whatever happened in the UK, you know the girl, she's recording herself everywhere. She goes, even she's a bathroom, she records. Tell me what is your business. Come and tell us your air business. If Cora record herself, whatever she does, Look at your mouth, the way you are using it to talk to Cora. Very, very disrespectful. I don't even really know what that Justin want before we move on. <laughs> My Cora, Cora people in the building, how on that day? Welcome back again to another vlog. Hmm. My people, my people, I greet you guys according to your time. And according to the time you're going to come across this video. I was just passing my own JJ Jelly until I come across this lady that says she's South Sudan. I would say she's reacting, right? Just like the way I'm reacting to Cora Bidi's sister Nancy. The video that she did, she made during the time that someone attacked Cora. I have watched that Nancy's video for like how many times to picture out where Nancy disrespected South Sudan and I didn't see my, my beautiful people. Just like when you are making making a statement and you make some references, she just mentioned like about three countries. She didn't specifically focus on South Sudan. But because this woman, if you see this woman video, I will let you guys watch the video at the end of the video. She was just addressing Cora like she has business with Cora. Like she had fight with Cora. If Cora is not dressing up fully covered the way you want it, you don't have to dress her like that in such a disrespectful manner. That is her business. You are acting like I don't know Cora, whatever she called herself, blah, blah, blah. But in your video, you just talk like you watch her, you follow every bit of her, of her videos. Cora made the announcement where you don't like her. Stop watching her block her because if you are not watching her you won't see what she's doing that's gonna annoy you and on the other hand justin didn't keep dragging keep dragging if, if i made this video i will not talk it again and the next thing boom justin will go and drop a quote he will go and drop boo boo quotes hey justin then when are you going to move on? Take a look at what Justin wrote. My four years old, my four years old is twerking at me and thinking it's cute with WT whatever. How is this women supporting women? Protect the innocent for F's sake. My correct, correct people. Why is Justin shading Cora now? So if you're a doctor, and your child knows things concerning a daughter. Is it a bad thing? Cora is a dancer. Definitely for sure. One among the two girls must know how to dance. If you're a cook, one of your child must take you, must copy, must emulate. The spirit must flow. The only thing that you're going to tell me is that if you don't want your daughter to dance, then tell her not to dance. <laughs> Justin, then, if you don't want your girl to dance, tell her, please, don't dance. You just want to condemn your ass for every single bit, for everything. You, now that is a narcissist, you should be praying that your kids should not come and copy you. They should not take after you. They should not act like the way you are. They should learn how to move on in every situation. Not you that cannot move on. My correct, correct people, let me leave you guys to watch Nancy's video bit by bit i chased this south sudan woman to come out to run them out we are all blacks but south sudan because this is your face on her to me go on eh. a scare him on a scare him mm. you are you have done the worst that you can do yes you can prove that yes you were in there but you have incited enough hate for it to happen and that's enough now that is okay it's okay this girl is Kenyan, or at least she or South Sudanese. She has that face. She is African. She's East African. What did Cora ever do to you? She has not even crossed to your country for once. This girl has not. She doesn't know you or your family. She doesn't know who the heck you are. But you told her that you were going to you were going to get her, and you held the knife for two hours, two minutes, trying to penetrate her stomach. Because of what? Because you're jealous of stars or because you're jealous of, of her body or because you're jealous of what? <laughs> because of what? 
I was in the middle of the, I, I I had to leave everything and find a way. My phone was dead. I I I I, stood, I stayed on the phone until my phone died. I just thank God for the UK police. I thank God for them. What would I have said? What would I tell my father? I put my sister in a room. I put my sister in the room and I left my sister in the same hands. And somebody online, because they say that, okay, they're supporting somebody for content against another person. I was attacked in London with a knife and an acid. It happened, but I'm not making it up. And I don't deserve this. I've not done anything to anyone. All I do is dance and sing and cook in my kitchen and I just want to survive. And I escaped with this. Thank you to everyone. I'm still your singing dancing princess. And this is not the end. This is just the beginning. Hold on to the knife. And I'm still here. Still standing. Finally, the wall is gonna see. This is not until my body is in a body bag before they see that I'm going through a lot of hate, visceral hate. And I'm grateful that this, at least I have ample evidence of this. Thank you guys. So Cora, the Nigerian singer, dancer, choreographer, whatever she does, West African Nigerian lady. Yesterday, her and her sister went on a rampage, okay? Disrespecting South Sudanese, okay? Whatever happened in the UK, you know the girl, she recording herself everywhere she goes, everywhere she used the bathroom, she record herself. You understand? Anything she do, she record herself. Eh? Leaving the Airbnb, something happened, somebody mocked her, Okay? Some perpetrator attack her with so-called acid and knife. Who know what? Whatever I heard is the perpetrator had on a hoodie. Hoodie, you couldn't see them. Okay. But the sister and the score, they jump in. They keep changing their story. First, they said the attacker was Uganda. Then they said the attacker was a Kenya. Then the big sister fixed her lips to say the attacker was a South Sudanese. One thing I'm going to say is, South Sudanese, we don't mind. We don't mind this girl. We don't have nothing to do with her. We don't care about her too much. That a South Sudanese will, will wait at the door to pour acid and, and attack her with a knife. Is her ex-husband dating a South Sudanese? Do she have a situation with South Sudanese? South Sudanese don't have nothing to do with this woman or her ex-husband. So why would you think South Sudanese, what person is sitting outside waiting with the acid and the knife? Where is this? What is this? That's all I got to say. This Nigerian dancer, her and her big sister, the whatever they say yesterday, pissed me off so bad. Okay? She said because of the face. What face when the hoodie, when they was wearing the hoodie? What face was the perpetrator showing? But they were wearing a black hoodie. But they were Uganda. Then be, they became Kenyan. And then they become a South Sudanese. Which South Sudanese loser is waiting outside for your sister? Which South Sudanese? Do you think the way your sister moved like this? That's... We see that as very low in our country. I don't know what they are doing in, in Nigeria. The way your sister behave online, we consider it the low of the low. The way she, you guys might adore her. Trust me, nobody's idolizing her in South Sudan. Nobody's idolizing in South Sudan. Somebody have akula, like the body itching, eating. Huh? So please. And today, the Cora lady, she jumped online looking marvelous. By the way, she looked very beautiful. She don't look like anybody who had acid poured on her face. Not at all. Okay? So whatever agenda, whatever tricks you guys have, whatever you guys do for social media, please keep South Sudan out of the way. We already going through enough. Okay? 
We're already going through enough. And if you know anything about South Sudanese women, if you want to get the next woman, you sit in your house and everything gets taken care of. Hey, okay? No South Sudanese woman is sitting outside with an acid and a knife for no woman. Let me tell you. The that. one you talk is enough already. Madam South Sudan, were you there? Were you present at the scene? Twisting down your tongue up and down. If you think that Cora is retaining you, you don't like her on that channel, please deviate off. Stop watching. If you don't watch Cora and Nancy, her sister, how do you hear? How do you know that uh, Nancy mentioned South Sudan, Kenya, or whatsoever? Yeah, the way you are talking, it looks like you know the attacker. Please, if you know the attacker, tell her to deviate. Stay off Cora. If like, make Cora wear shirt. If like, let Cora decide to be naked. It's her business, not yours. You should worry more about this. You're all covered and that your lipstick that is looking like a chicken fowl. That somebody will see you and they will be running. Say, Kochimo, who is this? Even with your full cover body, Sudan woman, Cora is far better than you. Go and fix your life. Go and fix yourself. And leave Cora to fix herself. She's just singing and dancing. Like as she said, if you don't like her, just like the way you come out, you are speaking for the whole South Sudan. You only know yourself. You don't know other South Sudan. The correct, correct people like this. I will drop the video here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye, guys.